What's up, everybody? Welcome to uh, Log On Games Reacts to the Nintendo Direct, September 13th, 2022. I didn't go to bed till very late, and now I'm tired, and I want me Nintendo to wake me up. That's right. You know what would wake me up, me? Andrew? Metroid would wake me up, you know? Mm. This Gatorade, actually, sugar, sugar-free Gatorade will wake me up. I actually think we see something Metroid today. Now, I know that this is supposed to be focused on um, Switch says, games launching this winter. Roughly 40 minutes of information, mostly focused on Switch games launching this winter. But yeah, roughly, you know what I mean? <sighs> Most? Yeah, no. What does that mean? That means uh, they're going to be focused on that for a while. Oh, it's starting. What do you see on your screen? You see COVID nineteen? Yep. I see. Oh, there it is, boys. That's loud. We're starting. I think we're going to see mostly that, but I think they're going to show something Metroid for the first time in a hot minute, and it's going to be worth it. Here we go. We live on the continent. Get out of here! Closed captions. Four realms surrounding a holy land at its center. What is this fire emblem? A thousand years ago, our lands endured a vicious war with the fell dragon. We called upon heroes from other worlds to aid us. Oh heroes boy. known as emblems. With them, the warriors of our Fire emblem. <laughs> in the end, we were victorious in defeat. Should have, I mean, that should have been number one on the, the list. They're going to show something fire emblem. They always do. In the years since, I hope it's a... Has been safe. Four but characters now, for Smash Brothers. I sense a resurrection. Smash Brothers come. There's more Smash characters. They're all here. All the fire. That person right there's got two different colored eyeballs. He sure does. Shoot. It's a GameCube game. It does look very GameCube, doesn't it? GameCube come back. You want a home console? You got me. I'm wearing a Kanto hoodie in hopes that we see the engaged. You're awake. You get to be engaged. You're really awake, yeah? A thousand years. That's it. That's how long I've been asleep. He's been asleep for a thousand years. Okay, good. I was about to say, what kind of Fire Emblem game is this? Is this another depart, depart, uh, departing from their main kind of thing? But it looks like, like a normal thing. Yeah, this looks like a legit. This is legitness. I'm happy about this. Uh, I have a friend uh, back in North Carolina, Tyler, who's going to be flipping his crap. I think I've just, I played the last two Fire Emblems. The last one was him. phenomenal. It was good. I'm just, I think I'm just Fire Emblem out for a bit. Gotcha. So much Fire Emblem. So all well, Three Houses was just, to me, by I mean, it was so much better than any Fire Emblem game that's come out before. Um, even though I've liked the last two a lot, I think I think that has definitely, their, their uh, fan base has definitely grown, especially from the last one. I just want to see the Pokemon Starters Evolution she asked me to gather all tree. The That's all I care about. Today. We're, we're going to see the Fire Emblem Evolution tree first. There it is. I really don't further, like that logo. We're <laughs> going further, Matthew. I had a dream. That's pretty soon. I had a January dream 20th. that our that our cousin Ron Hello, was everyone. doing <laughs> underground magic for people for I'm celebrities. That's I'll not a dream. For today's <laughs> what you just saw was the nice. latest. That's uh, January. That's a lot quicker than I would have expected that one. I thought that was going to be a. Uh... To the standard version, will also be releasing Ooh. the Fire Emblem Engage Divine Edition, containing special yeah. edition. I really don't like the Engage font. Please look forward to more in that logo. About this game in the future. 
There's roughly 500,000 okay. people watching right now. First batch of headlines. Oh, watching first us? batch of headlines. What? 500,000 people watching us? Yep. <laughs> Better be. Cody and May's it takes two to tango. So was it takes two not on the Switch until just now? When Correct. Turned into dogs. Me and Emily played to get their about back, six hours of this game of challenges. We're working together is the and beat the first level. Forward. And I looked up how long each level is supposed to take, and it was like about an hour to two hours each. I was like, yeah, me and Emily are never finishing this. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, I definitely want to play this with Nicole. But probably not on the Switch. Oh, yeah, you don't want to do that right there? You can play split screen on the handheld Switch and pass your controllers around. With a partner, of course. Oh boy. That, takes two. This is a game that I feel like will. It should have come out on the Switch before now. Today on the and, uh, November fourth. It should have. Uh, I don't know. The audience, the audience of Nintendo feels like that would uh, that would sell well. That would do well. Fatal Frame. I think they've announced this before. Is that what it is? I know almost nothing of Fatal Frame. Take pictures to ghosts. That's all you need to know. After mysteriously vanishing as a child, oh, I do remember Luca Fatal Frame games. In a maid outfit. An abandoned hospital in search of as one wears. Memories. As one wears. To, I always do. Take pictures. When I take pictures, mm -hmm. I always put that same dress. On. Always. Use the camera obscura to repel evil spirits and uncover the memories that were sealed away. This is absolutely for the same audience that will play It Takes Two. Then you can go straight from that to this. Exactly. Fatal Frame. Mask of the Lunar Eclipse launches for the first time in the West on Nintendo Switch next year. All right. Fatal Framing. They start show the same trend. looks mechanical? Oh my gosh. Introducing Wave 2 of the Xenoblade Chronicles 3 expansion pass for the Xenoblade Chronicles 3 game. This is Eno. How about it? There are people that are loving this. I'm not one there of those people. Mechanical? Complete her quest to have her join. Right, she's party. drinking yellow juice. Expanding your options for classes and battle strategies. I was hoping my options Challenge for battle strategies would increase. Test your medal in consecutive battles against tough enemies. Defeat all enemy waves to earn rewards. Challenge even Good music, though. enemies to earn valuable accessories. I mean, I bet Jason weapons. Montgomery somewhere is happy about it. Yes. More hero and gameplay additions will arrive in Wave Three. Oh, Wave, wave Three two of the Xenoblade Chronicles Three Expansion Pass launches on Nintendo Switch October Thirteenth. Get drawn into these Nintendo Switch games. Get Not drawn. all nonsense begins when SpongeBob and Patrick make a wish that unravels the very fabric of the universe. In this 3D platforming it's adventure, Debbie. you'll travel through portals to seven. I wonder how much money like prehistoric kelp forest, SpongeBob has made people fields. over the years. Or using all sorts of wacky moves. <laughs> It's a large number. Fantastic cosmic costumes and meet your favorite bikini bottom residents from the TV series, voiced by their original actors. That's it. Soak up SpongeBob SquarePants, the Cosmic Shake, launching on Nintendo Switch next year. All right. Time. You're already fit. It's me. Box with familiar characters from Here we go. This is the North Nintendo Star. I want. They'll be your instructors in exercise mode. This is exactly the Nintendo I want right now. Defeat as many enemies as you can with just your fists in just battle fist. mode. Or take on rivals in boss battles. Including hope this is a Jackie, full $60 game. Boxing, fist of the North Star. I'm about to say, if this is a cheap <laughs> game, it's a good workout. No, this, this needs to be their first $70 dodgeball. game. Dodgeball! You can at opponents in this hilariously hard-hitting party game. Embrace the absurdity of frantic mini That actually looks fun. Each one featuring ridiculous rules in madcap arenas. Customize this is your already out, maybe. Head to toe with hundreds of accessories. Maybe. Plus, challenge up to six friends and frenemies in local and online play. They won't even know what hit them. Oddballers launches on Nintendo Switch early next year. 
Tunic. A small box washes ashore on a ruined island. Brave the unknown in this isometric action adventure. Have you played game. Tunic? Your only clue here no. is the manual. I haven't either. I know a lot of people really like it. Heard a lot of good things. It's missing pages. Dangerous traps and even more dangerous monsters. This has been out for a while and other things, right? Mm hmm. I think a new one just recently came out. Maybe. Oh, gotcha. Or maybe there's one coming out. Nintendo Switch system, system September 27th. Two weeks away? Today on Two weeks from today? Shop. New Intel has arrived for these front mission remakes. This is 40 minutes and the hits right now are just a coming. Remakes of two front mission games are storming in. <laughs> hit after hit right now. One remake. Front mission remake. Yes, please. Yeah. I know, but my point is, they are actually. I, I am interested in this one. But um, um, I mean, they're not really dawdling on on any one game. These are back to back to back. Because they gotta make time. Stuff. You know what I mean? Something. Continue the battle in the sequel, previously unreleased outside of Japan. Take advantage of additional features like more terrain effects, weapon and armor attributes, and over 80 new skills added from the first game. Front mission they gotta announce the next Animal Crossing, you know? Switch this November. Front that would be wild. Will launch on Nintendo Switch next year. When they announce and Animal Crossing, are people just gonna assume there's another pandemic coming? Three will also yes. launch I mean, I'm Nintendo Switch. Be hoping there is, you know? <laughs> It's a wonderful life for a new it generation. Is. After nearly Introducing cows. Years, Does Emily play this game? Frame rate already looks reborn. great. No. Welcome back to Forgotten Valley. Not It's a Wonderful Life. She's more of a Tamadachi life kind of person, right? By your father. She is. Now, if they announce a new Tamadachi life, I, I'll call her live crops. right now. For your friendly animals <laughs> she at work. The land yeah. Flourish. Befriend the townsfolk while you're out and about in the valley. She played Emily just randomly one day you last year started playing Animal Crossing and she played it like every day for like a week and then just stopped and never touched it again. Those around you will grow older as oh, time I feel like that's a game she would like. Can do that. Their appearances will change over the years. Your child will also choose their career based on how you raise them. What if you raise them terribly? Do they become a murderer? Especially wonderful farm life and <laughs> Did they put that in the game? Yes. That's uh, probably like the worst career your child can be can take is a barista. Seasons, a wonderful life launches I don't mind these games. Switch. I like these kind of games in uh, um, Stardew and Harvest Moon. Summer 23. See, we're already out. Oh, Splatoon in right now. Splatoon. Listen up, it's going down. See what you did there. Splatfest, Splatcast. The first post launch Splatfest for Splatoon 3 has been confirmed. Here's the theme What would you bring to a deserted island? Gear, grub, or fun? Team fun. Oh, interesting. Three teams at one time? A three team so in it. Many incredible possibilities. Which team That's chaotic think? if there ever was one. There, if there ever was chaos, it was this. And more free updates are planned for Splatoon 3. Well, I would hope so. Be on the get those dance moves. In the future. Gotta get those dance moves. Team fun. So, Squids, what did you think? It's what great. would you bring to a deserted island? As for me, I've already decided. I hope you'll all participate as well. He's not gonna tell us what he's decided. <laughs> Next, please take a look at this. Square, square next. Square. Octopath two. Amazing. It is. We did it. I haven't finished the first one yet. Traveler series. Better hurry up. You won't know what's happening. Embark on a journey through the land of Celestia. With that, we could realize a world without conflict. It doesn't look like it's related. I'm going to become a star, 
and bring smiles I mean it looks like it you know like Fantasy, Final Fantasy games, you have one and two, and they're just not the same, not the same people. It kind of looks very similar. It's same, obviously, Square, so. Not again. Not this stench. Not this stench. I need to finish Octopath, and I need to get Triangle Strategy as well. That big old lizard. That's a big old boy. Explore a wide world set in a bustling era. Each traveler's path action differs between day and Interesting. night. Interesting. That's cool. Turn in, they all turn zombies at night. The twist this <laughs> happen when their paths intertwine. What's that big round? Let's go to Okay, in the first game, there's not much intertwining of stories. What adventures await them in this There's not any really. I think I found a source. The bunch of crazy animals. Story to tell. Where will their journeys lead them? And you. Octopath Traveler 2 launches on Nintendo Switch. February okay. 24, 2025. Five months away. What you just saw was Octopath Traveler told me that. 2 from Square Enix. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> new heroes. Let's see. That looks good though. Headlines. I gotta point my finger up after I do it. A magical home is waiting for you. Welcome to your new fairy tale life in Fay Farm. Cultivate Farm game number two. Farm game number two. Lasting friendships. One more to go. Simulation RPG. This looks like a very, this, about say, this is a very different world. This one looks like it's actually a twist on that. Oh, okay. And yeah. you can fight and things and explore. Yeah, I'm down, down with this. Along the way, you'll befriend a lively cast of characters who call this island their home. Tend and grow Did it say who made this? Solo, or together with uh, the I don't think so. In local or online multiplayer, Maybe. By gathering resources they had nets. Items. You'll be able to customize it's like your you got some Animal Crossing action going on. Yeah. Even more. As the seasons change, new spell This seems like one of those games, like unlocked, like Animal Crossing. That'll help you restore that Zoria to its natural take splendor. over your life. Magic awaits. Phoenix Bay Labs. Farm, launching exclusively on Nintendo Switch. Spring. I'm 20. actually exclusive. I'm okay with that one. Okay with that one. <clears throat> it's a musical blast from the past. Here we go. The 35th anniversary of the Final Fantasy series with the latest theater rhythm game. Enjoy iconic songs like One Winged Angel, Torn from the Heavens, Suteki Dane, and more. There are 385 songs total. <laughs> I know that song. Gotta get it now. So you can play each stage while experiencing the series through the music. What do I know the song from? What's it in? What game is it in? Final Fantasy X. Two players locally can That's one. I had, in pair how do you know there? While up to four players can I wasn't paying attention. I'm looking up. Online multi -battle. What else Theater Phoenix Labs has made? Final Line begins its symphony on the Nintendo Switch system February 16th, 2023. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo mm. eShop. Phoenix Labs made Dauntless. After the game's launch, paid DLC songs mm. from the Saga series. That's their Clear only series. other game developed. They went from Dauntless to Octopath Fairy Traveler. Farms. Live alive, only two games I want to get is this game and the punching one. Additional songs. You want this one? Plus, this game is the punching one. Containing a season no, pass and I want a Guitaru Man 2. That's what I want. Melodies of Life will be well, they made a second one. Did they? I don't remember. That's a... Maybe so. It's been a hot minute. A cosmic adventure is just I see Bowser. Uh -huh. Oh, this must be. Blast off on an adventure of galactic proportions. Oh, this is Mario. Fart! Mario. I thought this was gonna be a new Mario game. Let's dive into exploration. Freely roam through all sorts of wondrous worlds, each one jam-packed with discoveries. No, they just they ported oh, it to the PSP. Hidden paths. They did not the make a guitar man. So they ported we are roughly halfway done. They're showing a lot of stuff. 
shops, you can get items that'll come in handy Even big stuff. Even the, um, like Fire Emblem. Team will earn rewards mm -hmm. and They're not stronger. spending a lot of time on it. Sparks are here to lend a helping hand. Recruit up to through. different sparks, each with their own special powers and skills. Did you play the first one of this? A decisive victory. Nope. It's pretty good. It's real simple, pretty easy, but enjoyable. Mario plus it needs that hard mode that you can Switch start on. Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. A gold Soon. edition can also be pre-ordered. Month and a half gold edition. Base game, weapon skins, and a season pass. Restore peace between humans and monsters. Always trying to do that. Rune Classic. Factory Rune Factory. On Nintendo Switch. Special. Take a break from quests to chat with the locals. Cultivate crops. And gotta be honest. This is no Fae Farm. Among other <laughs> third, third, third game that has farming in it. Also transform into a monster? That Fae Farm game is probably one number one on my list so far. Will vary depending on your form. And Octopath. Well, Octopath. To occur. Plus, a then brand new mode has been added to help you enjoy more And it's not that I super want Fae Farm. It's more that I'm like... Rune Factory 3 special <clears throat> very interested. I'm intrigued. Yeah, it kind of looks like it could be like Stardew Valley, just like a 3D Rune version. Factory. Plus, a new Rune Factory series will. A lot of people are loving that one. I do not care. More Nintendo, Nintendo 64. 64. Madden 98. 64. Mario Party. That's nice. You can play online. Mario Party 2. Are you just going to start naming all the Mario Parties, sir? Mario Party I was about to say, you could have said Mario one. Party 1, 2, and 3. Pokemon oh, Andrew. Stadium. Yes! Wait, I don't that's care. what we need a new one of. I don't like those games. But we need a new Pokemon Stadium. Yeah. This game sold... I think people love this game. I don't get it. Excite Bikes? All right. What a move. Nice, sick move. No fear. You can play a selection of Nintendo 64 games and enjoy many Pilot Wings benefits with an active Nintendo Switch Online Plus expansion pack membership. Well, I have that. Oh, and there's one more game we should. Oh mention. boy! It's the Metroid. It's oh, not. There you go. Ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. This would be the number one game that I would want from 64. Mm -hmm. Online play. Interesting. I'm going to call a job. With these Nintendo Switch games. Live your best life on the newly discovered continent of Antoesia in this immersive RPG. The Square Enix your best life. has really got to stop with these names. Character and deepen your relationships with just the locals. Take a step back. So, you'll gain their their game, I mean, the game looks interesting, whatever. The names of these games are just, from Square, are just ridiculous. Various Daylife. Put in, it's just two words that don't fit together. Hey, I just played, uh, just played this on PC a little bit, or on my Mac a little bit, um, last week. Then build machines to refine them into I would play it resources. much more on the switch Eventually, you'll construct multiple production lines like these this is not for everybody but no was, I, this, there was a game that I did never wanted to see again it'd be this one there's a game called satisfactory that is like this but in first person that I would really love to come to a console it's an art museum with her parents in this 2d exploration adventure it was spooky. Through a busy gallery the name of the game has two letters in it. Until one particular piece draws her in. She can get sucked into the painting. Uh oh. Will she be able to safely return to her own world? Every decision affects her fate in Ib. Launching <laughs> on Nintendo Switch Spring 2023. I'm intrigued by this one. If that's like a $15, $20 game. Battle League, where eight 
players locally are you gonna tell us that we can, can actually play for people on the same game. team now joining the roster are Pauline, a physical power can you not with fast movements no and strong tackles and and just three Kong, team. just two speedster with dazzling techniques and high really dumb accuracy. and it's very difficult more gear and another I did not stadium know are being added to tell what player you're supposed to be launches this month hmm. The final summer begins. There's gonna be no more summers after this. It's crazy. Nope. Are we gonna get another farming game? When strange islands suddenly appear, Riza and friends set sail to not this time. In order You're not to that lucky, Andrew. Land from impending danger. Dang it. Sprawling landscapes set the stage for your adventure. Freely explore oh, you can cut trees. World and forge your own path in this charming RPG. 11 heroes from all walks of life will join your party. Forget Octopath, you can get 11 in this. Work with your allies to activate various skills, which can be swapped out when needed. Teamwork is paramount after all. <clears throat> Teamwork makes the dream work, you know? New features are also in store. The keys to this lively key. adventure are in your hands. Literally. Mm -hmm. Atelier Ryza 3, Alchemist of the End, and the that Secret Tiles too much. Two of them. The that Switch title is too much. Wave 3 is on the way. I'm ready to wave 3 it up. Here's a sneak peek at two courses racing in Christmas. Wave 3. Mary Mountain from Mario Kart Tour. Nice. I like the tour tracks coming. Peach Gardens from Mario Kart DS. I know it very you well. Got him. I know it very well. Mm -hmm. Wave three of the Mario Just those Kart two. 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass <laughs> DLC for the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe game launches this holiday. Good, good. Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack members can enjoy this DLC at no additional cost. The DLC can also be purchased on its own. How was that? That no, was swell. We have some news to share about Nintendo Switch Sports. Golf. Oh, oh yeah. Update, golf will be added. I want it. course you can play these locally additionally up to eight players online can play at the same time on the same course in survival golf i want some survival golf in my life will be out Bloop. we previously announced that the update would release this fall however we'd like a bit more time for development so the update is I'll now go planned me? for this Ball! please wait just a <laughs> little longer next we have a special guest Mr. Miyamoto. I thought it was DJ Khaled. Hello. It's it's been been a while. DJ. I'm DJ. <laughs> Can you imagine? I have a few things I'd like to share Mario? with you today, including some news. First, as you may Give it heard, to me, Miyamoto. The Super Mario Brothers animated movie we're developing with Chris Melodondri from Illumination will release mm -hmm. next spring. And Super Nintendo World, which is entering its second year at Universal Studios Japan, will also open in Hollywood, California, in the U.S. Recently, we've been working on the finishing touches for both. Today, I'd like to talk a little bit about Pikmin. Okay. Mm. It's been over 20 years since the first game, and we're still working on the series. There were 20 years since this we released a Pikmin game. It's a smart device game we started with Niantic late last year, mm -hmm. in which players this. all over the world are planting flowers. Here's a quick rundown. Give me the rundown. The Give me the quick rundown. To play it. Pikmin Bloom is a smart device game Look, you can that skip. uses your location. I was about to say, why are we skipping? You have you to skip the player. You that looks work. exactly like Pokemon Go, just with different logos. All you need to do is take it with you on your daily walks or outings. You can look back at the end of the day and see where you walked. Send out Pikmin and collect the items they found that day. And feed them nectar. Give them the nectar. 
Something tells me this isn't going to land so very well. We take today? This is already out. Oh, is it? This has been out, this has been out for a, a minute. AR feature to take photos with Pikmin. Pikmin are all around you. Let's take a quick look at my screen. Please. I have nearly 700 Pikmin. They love Don't know what that means. If you give Pikmin nectar like you see here, their flowers will bloom. You'll also when see the number of out? steps you've taken that day. I don't know, but they're making it seem like it's map, not out. The clouds will clear along the path you walk, so you can keep I remember of the this. locations you've visited. I normally move around within Kyoto, but I've also been going to Osaka, to Universal Studios Japan. Came out October 26th of last year. I occasionally go to Tokyo as well. You'll say to yourself, okay, this time I'll try walking here. It makes trips and walks a lot of fun. This it's time I'll definitely go to the bad part of town. I don't think there's around. many people playing this game, and this might be their way to try to get people to play okay. it again. <laughs> now to the main event. Please take a look okay. at this. Main event me. This is not Pikmin Bloom. This is a new Pikmin game. It's called Pikmin it is. Ultimate. Or just straight pick me four. All right. That was the main event. That's right. Pikmin four will launch in twenty. He changed his shirt. Oh my god. He won't be showing any gameplay he today. Did? However, or did he? I don't know. Able to play like this. I don't know. From the Pikmin's I wasn't paying any attention. Near the ground. I also made a new. No, it's got to be new then. Nintendo Switch has made controlling the game simpler, meaning you can further concentrate on the core essence of Pikmin gameplay. We call it Dandori in Japanese, or strategically planning, deploying, and commanding the Pikmin. I hope you're all looking forward to Pikmin 4. Thank you, Mr. Koizumi. Okay, fair enough. Thank you very much. A lot of excited Mr. people Miyamoto. for Pikmin 4, I'm assuming. Now, let's move on to some more headlines. I missed it. Oh, thank goodness. Take your dancing game to the A lot of rhythm level. and music games, too. Rhythm, music, and farming. That's what we're getting into. Is it Dance Versus? Is that what it's called? Is this not just Just Dance 3? Oh, it is. Yeah. Or Just Dance 23. This is a video game series that has made some cash. New modes all year long. What does that even mean? How many modes so many can modes. you do with dancing? Booga bing. There's a new season on Just Dance, but it's only we're only gonna play this one song. I know, right? This will probably get us taken off YouTube right there. Never-ending party experience. <laughs> so does that mean there aren't gonna be any more? They're just gonna keep can updating them. The season of death. Boy, this is a lot different. Square, Square, is making, Square is making some games. The Gotta put farming in it. Season of returns. Death Quietus. Farming game number four. All. Travel the world and Jeez. find a way to put an end to the calamity in this life simulation RPG. This one looks Along like way, a large game that also has some farming in it. Though. Join your cause. Still, yeah, farming still counts. This looks like Final Fantasy with farming. Final farming. Fatal, fatal farming. Fatal. Octopath farming. Farming fantasy. Final farming. Demo later today. Harvest. That's not a great name, but the logo makes it look good. Oh boy. Devilishly good time. People happy for this one. After 500 years, Umbra Witch Bay. There are people that think that this game is taking 500 years to come out. So, that's 500 years. Okay, Shane of the Three. 
and in the second confronted demons to save her best friend. Where is the farming? Now in this Where's the farming? She'll fight to protect the world from the well, been in of man made bio development for so long. <laughs> you gotta get the farming in. She's gone from fighting for herself. You're, it's in the city, though, it's a rooftop others, garden. To fighting for the world. Those who have overcome their past histories with Bayonetta to fight alongside her. I hope they put this song in all the Luka. all the d dancing and rhythm and music and games. Another Umbra witch, Jean. New ally Viola also joins in on the action. Viola, she's got she got crazy hair. hair. I was about to say she got crazy hair. There's a lot going on there. In Bayonetta 3, what about the 28? Did we already know that date? Switch, October 28. I don't know. Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. After today's Nintendo Direct, a new trailer delving more into Interesting that they wouldn't show that. Official YouTube channel. Five minutes left. A dark fantasy mystery what are you thinking? Metroid? Creators of Danganronpa. You thinking? I have no idea. Zelda? This direct, although it's had some good stuff. Not much for me. Cases remain unsolved in this Not much I care about. It's been, it's been some good stuff, though. Some heavy hitters that have been in here. Called master detectives who come from <clears throat> all around the world. This background song sounds incredibly Persona. Mm. What? Meet Yuma, an amnesiac detective. That's not Yuma, that's Alfalfa. And Shinigami. It's like Danganronpa stuff. Dive into these you got blood all over you, Bo. As a trainee at the detective agency. Thoroughly inspect each crime scene to gather clues and evidence. When you're ready, Shinigami will conjure a realm tying it's Persona the meets to the truth. Ace Attorney. A mystery labyrinth. Overcome obstacles and manifestations of mysteries to edge closer to the actual events. However, what a strange idea for a game. Will attempt to hinder your progress during each case. Avoid their barrage of falsehoods and slash through <coughs> contradictions. Uncover I will slash through those contradictions. Of Master right Detective Archives, Rain Code, launching first on the Nintendo cool Switch. System. Rain Code. 2023. Definitely not getting that. And to the mm. village, if you dare. I will never play this game on the Switch. I Maybe would not either. I'd say it's going to be cloud, but I'm a little surprised that series is coming huh? to Nintendo coming to Switch. Switch as a cloud version. Why did your voice change, dude? Ethan Winters must face the horrors of the village because it's scary. Some lords to rescue his abducted that does not look very bad. I guarantee it doesn't look that good when you play it. No, there's no way. Switch, October 28th. You can download and try out the free demo today. Well, we can find you out. Can download, try out the free demo. Download the the free demo of the game that's already out. The Winter's Expansion DLC containing a new third person mode, additional story content, and more will launch December 2nd. See, that looked okay, but it's just, I just don't believe it's going to look that good. It won't. It won't. The series will be available as cloud versions on Nintendo Switch this year. All right, they're going in hot. All the res, all the resident email. Evil. Love those games, just not on the Switch. It's an action-packed lineup of Nintendo Switch games. Are they not going to have a big thing? Vanquish I'm sure. To your seafood. In this Kung seafood. I love seafood. By thrusting, shrimp. Trim I got frame rate. And parrying opponents. You'll right. This is just this is just one of those games that I just have never been interested in. Older and weaker. In turn, however, you'll learn new techniques to complete your mission. It's done Can well. People like it. I, I just don't really get. Runs out? I don't know. I got no interest. Onto Nintendo Switch November eighth. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Experience the events leading up to Final Fantasy VII in this exhilarating action RPG. Zach Bear right. is a young and ambitious soldier operative aspiring to become a hero. This <sighs> this direct has not had any cohesiveness. It's like one game's farming and the next game's Resident Evil <laughs> and dancing, and then it's just more a little all over the place. 
I mean, if you're a fan of farming, then you nailed it. This is your I am. Ever. I am a fan of farming games, so. All right. This is something I will probably play if it's not. We'll definitely more than end on something big. Which will, I mean, it, I don't know. Could be anything. It's probably Zelda. Yeah, but I'm hoping it's Metroid. If it is Metroid, people are gonna go. Where the heck is Zelda? I'm gonna say it's still not ready. I would play this. Recruit a team of shipwrecked heroes and make your way out of a derelict Even if it is Zelda, I think people would rather see Breath of the Wild 2, but it'll probably this be like game, Wind Waker remakes and then that'll be it. Yeah. By the way, this game right here looks interesting, except for the fact that every screen we see of people walking around, they're going so slow. I would never want to go through a dungeon that slow. There better be a sprint button. Up to three players in online co-op can attempt to escape their grim fate. Do you have what it takes? Endless Dungeon launches on Nintendo Switch next year. The journey of world regeneration begins oh, anew. We're 40 minutes into a 40 minute thing. Tales of Symphonia is coming to Nintendo Switch. The world of Silverant is controlled by shadowy forces called Desiance. I remember playing this game quite a bit. Person known as the farming, one farming, the farming. Lloyd soon embarks on a journey. Is that Lloyd Christmas? The current mm -hmm. chosen one and his childhood friend in this beloved action RPG. They'll meet allies along the way, like the wandering aristocrat Zellos and a lumberjack who lost her emotions after an experiment, Prisea. Okay. Other allies will also join the party. Those lumberjacks sometimes they lose their emotions, you know. Fate of two I would. connected worlds hangs in the balance. Tales of Symphonia it's a good game. Remastered begins its journey on Nintendo Switch early next year. Still the best one. We got a montage. Life is strange collection. Oh. I've not heard of that in a hot minute. You, if that game's uh, sixty dollars and you get to build Lego stuff like that, it's cheaper than actually going and buying Legos. So. Fall guys. Is this cross play? I think so, yeah. Oh boy. Kirby's Return to Dreamland Deluxe is coming to Nintendo Switch. It said 40 minutes, One right? Day, a spaceship it said roughly. On Planet Popstar. We're 42. To help Magalore return to his home planet, Kirby and his friends set off on an adventure. In addition to sword, whip, and other familiar <laughs> copy abilities, the new mecha copy ability makes its debut. Blast foes from a distance, or punch them I'd be mean, much more likely to play this one than the new one that just came out, a 3D well. one. The game supports local play for up to four players on the same system. Plus, everyone can play as Kirby while using their favorite Kirby everyone. We got everyone everybody. Everyone plays Kirby in a Kirby. All Kirby's all There's the also time. A collection of sub games to play. This includes the new sub game Magalore's Tome Trackers and returning ones like Samurai Kirby. Uh, Samurai Kirby. All sub games can be played with up to four players. That's even. You've heard of hot potato. Well, how about throwing a bomb around? Adventure of Deluxe Proportions awaits. Kirby's Return to Dreamland Deluxe cool. launches on the Nintendo Switch system February 24th, 2023. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. As part of Kirby's 30th anniversary, a remake of Kirby's Return to Dreamland will be released. Mm -hmm. We hope you're looking forward to mm -hmm. this game. <laughs> Thank you for watching today's Nintendo Direct. Better give me something.
This next trailer will be our mm -hmm. last announcement. Please. Metroid and Holiday of 2023. <laughs> Metroid is out right now. Well, I was wrong. Game footage, not final. It's not final. Nope. It, it just is, stops right here. That's the last thing we see. It is, well, that's all you get of Zelda. <laughs> they haven't said when Breath of the Wild's coming out, Breath of the Wild 2, or whatever the Zelda game's called is coming out, have they? No. Nope. They, like, they just said 20, 2023. I think you'll get a, at least a window here. Run harder. You just dove into just to your death. What is this? Commit suicide. No. <clears throat> New gameplay loop. Come back to life and farm. That's why it's been taking so long. I've been farming. Have you ever wanted to be reincarnated into a farmer? Tears of the kingdom. Tears of the king. Tears or tears? Oh man, we got problems. We don't know which one they did. Five twelve. There it is. It's right, before, it's right before my birthday, Andrew. You can buy it for me. There it is. That is the Nintendo Direct for September thirteenth, two thousand and twenty-two. Matthew, give us your thoughts. I'm. I want to know if they went for tears or tears. I don't want to, because everybody's going to online be like, tears of the kingdom, and they're going to be like, it's tears, or vice versa. I don't know. They said that they've been holding out uh, saying the title because it's going to spoil some major parts of the game. So okay. I don't know. <laughs> and now we have the title. I don't know if that was true or not. <laughs> they're like, now you know. It's going to be know what's collect. Well, I mean, one of the big things in. Uh, in the in in Breath of the Wild was going around and collecting all the little thingy hackers. I assume you're going to be going around and collecting about a billion tears. So um, I hope so. Whatever that means, whatever that means. But I think as simple as that little teaser really was, it wasn't even a trailer, just a little teaser. The date is, I think it's good. It's a uh, actually a little sooner than I thought it would come out, and I know people are like, "What?" But yeah. It's a little soon. I thought we're looking at least holiday. So, yeah, a lot of well, games. Uh, for me, not a lot of anything. Sure. I could have woken up personally. I could have woken up and seen the Breath of the Wild two release date and been like, "All right, not really seeing anything else." So I am sad this morning. Maybe PlayStation will PlayStation later today will make me happier. You know. Yeah. Um, if you're watching this Octopath before, Octopath is a big one. Yeah, Octopath too. Oct I, I would play Fay Farm. Fae something. Fay Farm. A lot of farm. A lot of farm stuff. Fire Emblem. A lot of farm. But... Yeah. If you are, uh, I mean, on paper, you know, you see Fire Emblem, Pikmin, Breath of the Wild two, and. Bayonetta 3 and you're like oh this is a big direct but I'm not a fan of like most of those except for Breath of the Wild 2 but gotta wait till May wait till May well if you are watching this before the PlayStation State of Play we will also be doing a live reactions to that so uh, hit that subscribe button if you are on uh, YouTube right. watching this and uh, look forward to the State of Play reactions later today as we will see 20 minutes of Farming. Thing. I hope we get another farming game. A VR <laughs> farming game. Um, but that's going to do it for us here. We will be with you all next time. See ya.